review of the secret language of color cards. Very useful if you're into vibration and vibrational energy and healing. It's by In Inga Inna Seagull and the reverse of the box is there for you. You can find this obviously online and I'll put the link in the description box. There are 45 cards with this and they all have color, creativity, joy, peace and balance that you can find in each card. They are published by Blue Angel, so I'll leave the link down below. The booklet itself obviously goes through each and every card. You have the card color there, the name, the quote of the card, how to utilize the card and what it's used for. So it does discuss the beginning, if we go through the beginning, obviously the index there, the power of color, how do people use color to heal, So a nice way to utilize these cards at the beginning or at the end of a reading, how to use the secret language of color cards, asking questions, chakra clearing with the cards, working with other people, meditating, eating or drinking the color, wearing the color, surrounding yourself with the color, spending time in nature, painting, being creative. What is on the cards? How do I develop an intuitive connection with the cards? Why do I sometimes react negatively to a color? What colors do I need to work with? Do the colors or the colors carry a healing frequency? So do I need to do the process and the card messages? So that's the book that there, the guidebook. I will quickly put up the cards and at the end, I will obviously shuffle and do a reading. We're starting from the reverse here bronze strengthen your body they have numbers on the corner the cards are relatively good it's not going to be a deck that you're going to shuffle frantically seeking your message it's, it's there for healing so the cards should always remain in good quality and in con good condition rainbow connect to fairies in nature lemon access innovative thinking yellow purify your body brilliance discover your brilliance pearl strengthen your connection with the divine white it's time to lighten up violet create a balanced life so you can see that this is going to be an oracle deck we'll, we'll, we'll as i said pull cards at the end of the we will pull cards at the end and then you can receive a message cyan build your confidence turquoise awaken your empathy gray learn to scan your body silver be persistent coral allow flow and synchronicity into your life Scarlet attracts success. Ruby, rejuvenate your body. And this is just reminding me here with some of the items popping up. You know, you can buy flowers of this color. You can wear this color. You can look at the card. You can eat this color. There's so many ways to incorporate color into your life. Walk in nature, looking at this color, going around the shopping center, focusing on all the red objects. Red, free yourself from pain. Lavender, body, mind, and soul connection. Purple, develop mental clarity. Watermelon, have fun with your inner child. Rose, attracting a relationship. Pink, let love in. Tangerine, be spontaneous and fun. Peach, inhale a breath of life. Amber, awaken your creativity. Orange, nurture yourself. Lilac, strengthen your faith. Cherry, live an extraordinary life. Plum, overcome your challenges. Burgundy, awaken your passion. Magenta, connect to your deepest inner knowing. Mauve, enjoy clear hearing. Interesting. Indigo, improve your vision. Jade, take action. Emerald, calm your body, mind and soul. Green, revitalize your nervous system. Apricot, rejoice and lighten up. Gold, attract abundance. Black, find riches from the dark night. Auburn, ground yourself. Brown, establish boundaries. Chocolate, nourish your body and soul. Love this message. Who doesn't love chocolate? Aqua, experience peace and calm. Azura, protect yourself. Sapphire, rege regenerate your body. And finally, blue, activate your healing power. So that's the 44 cards. Let's choose a card if you are here today, tomorrow or in the future. What is something that you need to learn and listen to? and incorporate into your life which color pink let love in so we're going to page 25 with the pink nifty cards aren't they okay 25 pink pink is the energy of unconditional love it opens your heart and helps to heal heart problems 
It assists with releasing emotional challenges and brings tranquility. Pink also helps with insomnia and assists with the manifesting of dreams. Open your heart with delicate pink colours. Love. So this card does have a meditation as well. So let's do this meditation. You can sit, lie down. Become aware of any tension in your body. Take a deep breath in and allow your body to soften. Focus on letting go of any hardness or density. Close your eyes and imagine you are holding the most beautiful pink rose. Breathe in its sweet scent and allow its beauty and delicateness to open your heart. Then imagine pink light from the rose flowing into your heart and filling it up with unconditional love. Now think of someone you love and allow the love you feel in your heart to pour from your heart into theirs. Savour that feeling of love and connectedness. Say, Divine love, pour your healing light into my heart, softening it, purifying it and rejuvenating it so that it is shiny, loving and full of enthusiasm. So it's beautiful. So you have meditations with this. So I hope that you enjoy this deck. I will put the link in the description box for this deck. You'll probably be able to pick it up a little bit cheaper now. It's been out for some time. It has been out since 2010, so quite a while. And normally with older decks that are mass produced, you normally can get them quite discounted. That's the beauty of buying something that's not new and shiny, but yet is still current, that you can utilize this beautiful healing deck. Don't forget to like and subscribe where I review, do openings and readings on this channel. Until next time.